Welcome to another edition of Down to the Wire. Today we're catching up with Eric Nyhart, who is a top trainer from Fraser Downs. So Eric, what brings you here today? Uh, we come here to, we brought four horses, and we're here today, we're racing an elimination of one of the sire stakes. Can you tell us more about Tahuya Game Day and the other horses that you brought with you? Uh, Tahuya Game Day, nice three-year-old filly that we, we raised, we bred and raised her, and uh, she's turned out pretty good, so we're here to, you know, compete for the sire stake with her. The other horses we brought are just, uh, we brought one called Tahuya Rico, Tahuya Roadster, and Tahuya No. So do you have any favorites that you brought with you? No, I don't have favorites. I like them all, so. Yeah. Well, that's really nice. Everyone's on fair, fair playing field. Well, pretty much. We like the three-year-old filly, but uh, the other ones have been good to us, so we like them too. So can you tell us where the Tahuya came from? Tahuya come from... My parents had a farm in Tahuya, Washington. So that's where the name came from. Pretty creative. Yeah. <laughs> so you're from Washington State, um, which doesn't really have a large standard bred scene. Uh, what got you into the industry? Oh, uh, years ago, my dad bought some standard bred horses. That's sort of what got me into it. So it's just a, a family run business? Uh, kind of, yeah, kind of. So he's involved in it and I'm involved in it. And just that's the only part of our family that's involved in it now. So, yeah. So you're, you're carrying on the family name? Uh, somewhat. We're in the horse business. You know, we've been breeding and raising horses for a long time. So, Can you tell us a little bit about the process of getting a horse ready for racing? Um, you know, from the start, I mean, you break them, get them going, you got to train them down. But when we're getting prepped for a race like this, you know, we brought her out here and, uh, you know, we, we trained her before we got here, made sure she was ready to come. And we raced her once, one start before, uh, she seemed to do good. So she's kind of prepped and ready to race. So, so is there anything special that you do? Any special rituals or, or lucky charms that you do before a race? No. No. You just take it one race at a time? Oh, everything's the same. We try to do the same thing, same routine with the horse. Can we expect to see you more more this summer, or is this like a one-time thing? I hope thing? so. I hope uh, we, you know, I hope for the next couple of weeks we, it makes us want to come back and race some more here. Well, we definitely hope so, too. So congratulations on your success at Fraser Downs, and we wish you the best of luck today. Thank you very much. Thank you for joining us on this episode of Down to the Wire. This is it for today, and we'll see you next week.